That's so annoying. All right, so this apartment. Oh my God, you guys. So it is like, <laughs> I'm so excited that I just can't hide it. I'm about to lose control and I think I like it. <laughs> I almost don't even want to talk about it and get like too excited because we might not get it, right? Because we're just like too, we, you have to apply for it and I'm like other people have applied families and it's like the size of the place is like for a family you know it's a very family oriented community it's like a gated community so um it's like all right i'm gonna describe in detail everything okay but I'm going to go bring the application soon because there's things you have to do, right? You have to get like a money order from the bank or a certified check from the bank for the deposit. Then you have to like um, fill out the application, get pay stubs and stuff like that. And like when you're a YouTuber, it's so weird to do all that stuff. It's not like conventional, you know? So the place is kind of like, it's like a townhome. Um, very beautiful outside. Um... You go in and like there's a family living there now but so it's like a viewing when like it, the place was really filthy and i think it's like a mixture of them having kids moving and just like not keeping up there i don't know well, i'm gonna give you a minute to look away oh Oh no, that's gotta go outside, it has spores. So I was like, you're going to clean and like renovate before we move in, right? Like they need to do that with our apartment now. Like we're not the cleanest people either. So, you know, um, and they're like, oh yeah, we're going to paint, put new carpet. Like they have to, right? So, so we go in, when you first go in, open the door, there's like pretty huge stairway to get up to the main level. Once you're on the main level, there's a humongous, huge, beautiful kitchen with like a humongous island in the middle of it. There's like an in built-in dishwasher, microwave, comes with fridge stove. Then there's like um, patio doors to go out to like a little patio. We could probably barbecue and stuff. <laughs> and um, then like off the patio, there's like a bathroom. So like a half bathroom, with like a toilet sink. Then um, further over to the left, there's your dining room area. It has really nice light, light fixtures. Then you have your living room, bright, huge windows. Um, there's a gas fireplace with like a mantle, which we will use to put our TV so we don't have to get a TV unit. Then you go up another staircase, a uh, pretty long staircase, to get to the top floor, which has the bedrooms. Now... <laughs> Each bedroom is at the opposite end of the hallway. In the middle, there's a room with like the hot water tank and um, washer dryer. Your own washer dryer, which is awesome because usually when you're used to apartment living, it's usually um, there's like, you know, a common community kind of a laundromat, you know, in the basement somewhere or something. This has your, you have your own. So not having to leave the apartment to do like your laundry is awesome, you know? Each bedroom is massive, like so roomy. The one bedroom, one bedroom has a balcony with like a cage around, like wiring around it so birds don't get in, but also so the cats can't get out, <laughs> which I won't leave them unattended anyways, but still. Um, it has 
humongous, like so much closet space, like walls of closets. In the middle, there's like a built-in dresser with drawers. Um, and here's the thing, each bedroom has its own ensuite private bathroom with like tub, shower, toilet, everything. Like, and then like in the middle of the community, there's the office and it has a gym which was like there didn't seem like there was ever anybody in it like there was no one at the time but um she said it's like usually not busy so I could film in there when I want to work out <laughs> you know and um in the back of the the area there's a humongous like it's like an almost like an olympic size salt water pool um for everyone to use and every night there's like uh, there's like time specific times where they have like private adult swim or whatever i'm really psyched like i hope we get this so bad there's like tons of room for the cats you know what i mean and because even though pizza and i are living gonna be living together we're gonna be living separate lives like we have this discussion um it's not gonna be exactly like when we used to live together like we're gonna have separate lives you know we're just like roommates someone to share the bills and like we're gonna hang out we're friends you know but yeah <laughs> anyways guys i gotta go pick up my grams bear I gotta go shopping before the major snow starts coming in yeah sucks <laughs> so anyways guys um i just wanted to talk about the apartment like i'm just like super psyched pete's really likes it he thinks it's really nice but he thinks it's like really big for the two of us but he also excuse me he's not picky like he just he's like as long as i have a room <laughs> okay you know and I'm just like, well, I'm a little more picky than that because like the other place we were looking at was just like the mood was really depressing, you know? Um, and I don't, I don't know, like I'm not comfortable like with elevators. So having to take one every day, I don't know. I just don't like the area. I don't like the apartment was like kind of gloomy looking from what I could see. It was like dark and not much like light coming in and like environment is like really important to me and I think the environment I'm in like now is not the best either so I think once I move somewhere um that's you know just really just better like you know <laughs> so I know I say you know what I mean a lot but anyway um so I guess that's it so I guess I'll see you guys in the in the next video. <laughs>